Well, tonight an investigation is underway in Tarpon Springs after police opened fire on a man wielding a military style rifle. Witnesses say at first he was pointed the gun at passing vehicles and then he turned it on officers. News Channel 8's Christine McClarty spoke with a man caught in the middle of that terrifying situation. She has the details from Pinellas County. Crime scene tape remains at the bottom of this mailbox just in front of the Tarpon Springs Chamber of Commerce. Saturday night, we're told a man was standing on this street corner with a military rifle pointing it at those passing by. I keep screaming, shoot me, shoot me, shoot me. And I'm with my dog, so I kind of pull to, to the side up against the building. I lie down because I don't know what's going on. Eight on your side spoke with two people who wanted to stay anonymous, but tell eight on your side they saw the whole thing. This dramatic video capturing the heart pounding moments. One man tells us he just moved here two weeks ago and can't believe he was feet away from danger at one point laying on the sidewalk to avoid the man pointing a gun in his direction before taking cover in an alley. I'm shaking inside now when I'm talking about it, so it's really yeah, it was terrible. Tarpon Springs police say the officer shooting happened at 930 Saturday night at the intersection of Pinellas Ave and Tarpon Ave. Officers say they received several calls about a man walking up and down the street pointing a military rifle at cars passing by. When officers arrived, they say he began pointing the gun at them. Tarpon Springs police say the officers opened fire, shooting him several times. They say officers immediately began giving him first aid. The man was transported to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. Police say the names of the man killed and the officers involved are not being released. The Florida Department of Law Enforcement and State Attorney's Office are investigating. This local says he still shook up trying to process the scary situation. Obviously, this can happen in a small town like this. It can happen anywhere, you know, without warning. And it's just, you know, it's just terrible. Stay with 8 on your side as we work to learn more details. Reporting in Tarpon Springs, Christine McClarty, 8 on your side.